What is this? Is this a vlog about me? Let me be in your blog. You can be in it. It's, it's just, we're just documenting what we're doing. So right now, oh, wow, my sister. Aww. I'm in Istanbul. You'll have to forgive my appearance. I'm obviously traveling, so I just kind of look like garbage. But right now I'm just sitting in the airport on a layover. I got a coffee and managed to spill it all over the table within like 15 seconds, which was cool. Raja has a couple performances in Switzerland, and then there's a fashion show too, so we're gonna go film those, and we're probably gonna take some photos, hang out in Switzerland for a day, catch up, and get some stuff done. Right now I'm sitting in the airport. I'm gonna finish editing a music video for her, but I'm gonna try to keep the travel down to a minimum and focus on the places I am versus getting there, because most people know what it's like to fly. It's not fun, why bother recounting it for everybody? One thing I will say though is that I managed to sleep a lot on this flight. Played a lot of Mario Kart, which is great, and then I watched a lot of TV. I don't have a lot of chances to watch TV because I just like, I don't know, when I'm home, I'd, if I'm like gonna have leisure time, I'd rather play games. But most of the time, I'm just like making videos, so I don't really get a lot of time to watch TV. So it was good, I got to catch up on some Modern Family and New Girl. They didn't say I watched good TV, I just watched TV on the flight. They do have on the flight La La Land and The Revenant, two movies that I didn't get to see that I wanna watch, so on the flight home, I actually can't bring any of my electronics because of the US travel ban so um, I'll be spending a lot of time with the in-flight entertainment. really want to watch La La Land and The Revenant and I brought a couple books too so I'm gonna get back to editing. I just wanted to say what's up and give you guys a little update. Next time you see me I'll hopefully be in Switzerland. Let's get it. I wish I understood anything they were saying right now. So I tried to be nice and bring Raja a coffee, but you just can't do that here from the hotel. I'm gonna walk over there right now. Man, it's crazy how beautiful this city is. Like, it reminds me obviously of home a lot, but the architecture is so beautiful and the colors are really nice too. And if you ever wanted to feel weird in the city, just walk around holding a tripod filming yourself with everything you do. People give you a bunch of weird looks. So last night I got in at like 11, didn't get back home until like one, and I stayed up until about four, slept for one hour, and then went with the promoter to go pick Raja up from the airport. Raja's staying up four flights of stairs. So it's good, even though I'm traveling, probably can't visit a gym, just get to do this the whole time. You know, she wanted a coffee, so I was like, oh, I'll just drop my stuff off. Off or go get her a coffee. <laughs> Little did I know what I was signing myself up for. Hi, Raja. Hi. It's so pretty out here. Hey. Even this fucking video. <laughs> So right now we're trying to pack into a car to go to soundcheck, which was supposed to be like two hours ago, but it's fine. Are you excited for the show tonight? Oh yeah. Well, hell yes I am. <laughs> <laughs> I think it'll be good. So due to a strange turn of events, I'm gonna drive a stranger's car and we're gonna get Raja back to the hotel, get her hair and makeup done, and get ready for the show in a couple hours. Wild. Well. I don't know where I am, so that's good. It's really pretty, and there's a McDonald's. I'm going this way. Oh, so it's a fashion show, uh, as you saw earlier, it's in a pool. At first, they couldn't get us in-ear monitors. You know, if you're listening to mute, like you're hearing the snare, and the snare is banging off the pool. Pretty much no way of knowing if you're in time, which is obviously not great when you're rapping. I really have no idea where I am, but I hope I'm pointing the right way. Honestly, none of this like really looks that familiar to me. Nice, I was right. That's where I parked the car. Also, just drove a stranger's car. Just was like, hey, can I take your car because we're in a rush? <laughs> and they said yes. So I guess that's the power of being a star. Thank you, Raja. I'm gonna run to my room, get her. Do I even need to get her anything from my room? She might need that power converter. So I'll go run and grab those and then sprint over to her apartment. It's funny because like two months ago, Divine was like, hey, Sean, you should try to be Raja's manager. And I was like, I don't think I'd be very good at it. But guess what I'm doing today? Being Raja's manager. It's almost showtime. Raja goes on in about five minutes. I just need to make sure that the sound is right because given everything else that's gone on today, it just doesn't make sense to not check that. Then as soon as we get that, she'll go on and perform. Then we can go home, go to sleep after this long ass day. Everything worked out. Sound's all set, lights are all set. I'm gonna go set this camera up for some behind the scenes stuff and then we're good. She's only performing four songs tonight, so it should be pretty quick. It's gonna be a good set though. We've got Believe In You, The Come Up, Mira, and Mute. So we'll be good. 